सो द नेम ऑफ द प्रॉब्लम इज बल्ब स्विचर इट इज अ फेमस लिट कोट प्रॉब्लम सो इन दिस प्रॉब्लम देर आर एन बल्ब दैट आर इनिशियली ऑफ ओके ऑल बल्ब आर ऑफ एंड इन द फर्स्ट राउंड वी हैव टू टॉगल एवरी बल्ब The meaning of toggle is if the bulb is switched off we have to switch it switch it on and if the bulb is switched on we have to switch it off so in the first round as all bulbs are switched off now all bulbs are switched on now in the second round we have to toggle every second bulb so like the second bulb is now off similarly the fourth similarly the eighth and so on sixth also in the third round we have to toggle every third bulb so the third bulb is toggled sixth bulb is toggled and so on now we have to tell the number of bulbs that are on after n rounds so now let's take an example of a number 12 12 is not a perfect square number so there are six numbers that can divide 12 completely they are 1 Into twelve, two into six, three into four. So in the first round, the twelfth bulb will be toggled because one can divide twelve completely. Similarly, in the second round, the twelfth bulb will be toggled again because two can divide twelve completely. Similarly, in the third and the fourth round, the twelfth bulb will be toggled since both the numbers can divide twelve completely. Now in the sixth round. the 12th bulb will be toggled again as earlier it was switched off now in the 6th round it will be switched on and lastly in the 12th round it will be switched off again so we can observe that any number which is not a perfect square have even number of devices now let's take an example of a number which is a perfect square like 16 There are five numbers that can divide 16 completely: 1 into 16, 2 into 8, and 4 into 4. So 1, 2, 4, 8, and 16 are five numbers can that can divide 16 completely. So in the first round, 16th bulb will be toggled. Similarly, in the second, so in the first it was switched on. In the second round, it will be switched off. In the fourth round, it will be switched on again. now in the 8th round it will be switched off and in the last round it will be switched on so in this case we can observe that a perfect square number have odd number of divisors so in this question we basically have to find out all the perfect square numbers from 1 to n and that will be our answer now we will code this question we are given a value n and we have to return an integer value which which will be our answer so we will create a counter and let's assign it a value 0 now we will run a for loop and check till what values of i equal 0 and i equal less than n i can create a perfect square okay for int i equal 0 i into i less than equals n i plus plus and inside we will increase the value of our count let's return it we have to start with one otherwise the answer will not come correct return i hope it is correct let's check so it is the correct code i hope you understand the problem